Hey everybody. It's 7.43 p.m. And I found me a sunset. <laughs> I found us a sunset. Yay. Looking at all the fishing boats out here and all the birds and Finding out the scoop on such things. I'm sorry, I really don't want to get that poor fisherman in here. I don't have his permission. <laughs> oh, I remember this time so much, Lord. And I so miss it. So the scoop on the state park here. I guess where I normally do my sunsets from, they have decided that it was so torn up that they're going to have to repave it so it will stay closed for the rest of this season. And the other park that I'm not allowed to go to anyways via the Lord <laughs> will be closed a whole lot longer because it was actually destroyed even more. There is another place that I can go to, a little farther down. But the girl told me to come down here and, um, well, they call them the fishing path. They told me to come sit on the rocks. That way we can hear the water lapping. Peaceful stuff. But this is definitely not an area that I would even consider for a minute staying past dark in. Nope, nope, nope. You know you got that feeling, right? <laughs> Looking up at the beautiful skies that we have today, kinda. It wasn't so nice this morning, but it's cleared up. We had uh, those kind of skies all day. All morning, the popcorny looking ones. <laughs> and Sarias. Oh my goodness, I wanted to get the stars and the planets and all that stuff. I've been looking forward to. Maybe I can talk somebody into coming out here at night with me. I see so much in the skies out here. And these amazing sunsets. Heaven still declares glory. No matter what. Lots of big bass in this lake. So we know y'all, we're waiting for the Lord and watching as we're supposed to do, constantly looking up, but we're waiting in faith, by faith, because we do believe He's going to park those clouds and call us up hither. We do believe we're in the season. Faith. Pleases God in faith. What he's looking for when he returns. Remember, God isn't trapped into time.
His timing, not ours. And he'll come in perfect timing, just like he always does. So I saw some of my white raptor birds. Uh, well, the couple behind me had them. <laughs> They're on them with binoculars. Those are my egrets, the white egrets. Oh, we got a family of duckies here. Hi, guys. I'm sorry. I didn't know you'd be here. I see turtles. Oh my goodness, there was a turtle right there. See him popping his head out? Aww. Lots of duckies. Sorry, y'all. We need to learn from the ducks. You notice how they go underwater and just let the water roll off of them? It's kind of like an analogy of how we got to let things roll off of us sometimes, right? Accusations and the lies, they can all be a little bit overwhelming at times, right? Of course they can. Not one of us is perfect. Not one of us is worthy. Thank you, Jesus, that you make us worthy. Thank you, Jesus, for your love, for your grace. Thank you, Jesus, for the cross. Thank you, Jesus, that it was finished. So on my little adventure, Coming out, I've already talked to a couple people. Oh, there he is. Did you see him? Oh, there he is. There's our raptor bird. He's gonna take us away. <laughs> yeah! Up, up and away! Oh, thanks for showing up. I don't see any Ken planes today at all. That was the past two days before it rained. And the sun's starting to set, so we get those beautiful, brilliant colors. Let's see if I can focus in on anything. Isn't he amazing, y'all? I don't know how anybody can get through a day without Jesus. I don't know how anybody can live their life not knowing Jesus. But I know God has a plan and it's all in his hands. There's some amazing stuff out here. Getting fast. It looks pretty round with my eyes. Good the camera doesn't. The 
so awesome. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for this moment. I'm glad I came by and found a spot. And I was able to bring y'all the sunset. Just need to find some peace. The joy of the Lord is our strength. His mercy endures forever. His grace is sufficient. And enough. He gives us our daily bread for today. Yesterday's gone and we take no thought for tomorrow. What a mighty God we serve. So as I just wanted to come and bring you some encouragement and actually just enjoy this myself. I'm being a little selfish but sharing. <laughs> no, I'm not. This feels like when I first started my channel, it was all about sunsets. And Jesus, of course. That's okay. Now that I know that the park will be closed, we will find a way to get us a better place. If we're still going to be here, who knows? It's imminent, right? At any moment, twinkle poof. In a nanosecond. Mm, follow the setting sun, y'all. So, thank you all for watching. I pray to have blessed you, encouraged you, gave you some peace. Hearing the water lapping is very peaceful. a little fish <laughs> a little throwback fish I guess and these colors are just majestic aren't they actually I think there's a color called magenta that kind of looks like that right <laughs> so saying that I'm gonna say that this is Debbie from Texas saying peace out Maranatha Let's keep looking up, brothers and sisters. Surely our king is coming, and he's on the way. Peace out from Texas. <laughs>